Hey guys, welcome back. What's going on? So, I had a day with Dad. Now, I'm going to have a day with Mom. So, Mom and I are going to go to Home Depot. And then after Home Depot, we're going to go to the junkyard. Because we have some things that um, we don't need anymore. Like some old TVs, some wood, some styrofoam. You know, just uh, junk. So... I've been loading it up in the back of the van. We're gonna take it to the dump and then go by Home Depot. Hopefully by the time I get back, um, some things will be cooled off by now because I got the fans and stuff running to cool off the studio. But hopefully by the time I get back, I'll be able to hang our new ATEC PC sign that I got for the inside of the studio. So plans, plans, and everything else in between. So yeah, and then hopefully I can get to organizing my workbench because this is what I really want to tackle, is my workbench. But, one thing at a time, right guys? So we are on our way to Home Depot. Going to the Homeless Depot to see about a new screen door and then that green stuff that I bought to go underneath my porch. Taking that back too. And then after that we have to go to the dump. And hopefully by the time I get back it'll be cooled off a little bit and I can work in the garage. Turn this. All right, mommy, you want to shut it for me? To Home Depot. All to the Homeless Depot we go. I like the Home Depot though. All the cool stuff they got outside. All the tractors and everything else. Very cool. All right. Enter. <laughs> I don't see it. I'm looking for the industrial glue sticks and I don't see any of it. So uh, I guess they don't carry it. They don't carry glue sticks here. You believe that? Wow. This is their entire glue section. All right. Okay, on to the next. Wait a minute, Dad bought this? Yeah. For, for your house? Yeah. Here, let me, let me film That's it. That's it. What is it? It's an HG black slate? Is that what he paid for it? Yeah. He paid this kind of money for it? Oh my god. Wow. It is nice though. It is a nice fridge. So this is the fridge that's in your house? That's pretty cool. Hmm. He bought the dishwasher too that goes with it? Oh, all right. Very cool. New what? New refrigerator. All right, moving on. Well, they threw my whole, they threw my whole day off with this whole, we don't sell glue sticks. So I'm like, that sucks. What are we looking for? I screen doors? Oh yes, yeah, screen door. Looking for a screen door. Oh, she already found them. Okay. No prices on these? How do you know which one we need? You measured it, right? Oh, at the top, 30. Yeah, you said it was about 30 bucks for a door. 31.98. And all we need is just something cheap and simple to replace the broken one. Mm -hmm. All right, so we need a 38. 36 by 80. 36 by 80. And that's a 36 by 80. Right all right, so that's what we need. Yeah, you know. 
mom don't like my idea of buying paint brushes at the dollar store I told her you can get three for a dollar she's like nope ain't happening we're getting real paint brushes and now we're looking for primer because apparently you have to seal this this isn't sealed so we have to get um, a sealer and a primer so we can prime it and seal it or seal it and prime it whatever you want to call it damn you think they got enough buckets look at all the buckets down through here Primer and sealer interior. Oh, I'm gonna go look at the paint brushes real quick. You just need one that's angled, right? But you need a cheap one. Let's see here. We need a paintbrush, but we need one that's angled and that doesn't cost twelve dollars these are two and three but you see how they say flat flat we need one that is not flat we need one that's angled like that angled but they want eight dollars for it that's crazy then angled five bucks I bet oh that's too much then Hmm, let's see here. I don't think this is the place to buy paintbrushes. Honestly, I think we can get a better deal elsewhere for them. Here's a multi-pack. But is it... It looks like it's all the same brush. Hmm, okay. Maybe we'll go to Walmart. Because we have to go to Walmart anyway. Maybe we can find a better deal there. I wonder if this can is discounted. Considering the gigantic drop mark in it. Probably not. They'll probably charge you more, actually. They'd be like, sir, this is a uh, design. This is uh, extra money for this. That's how the can came designed. That's how we bought it. Bullseye. One, two, three, primer. Cool. What in the hell is that thing? Holy Jesus, you ever seen a can that long? Yeah. I feel like there's two cans in one in that sucker. Look at this thing. Holy Jesus, that's a big can. It's like a, like a mortar round, you know? <laughs> or a, uh, like a rocket launcher. Oh, that's a big can, look at this. All right, so we are done. We got our screen door and we got our paint. Now I just need to go home and deal with this and also organize. But now we are on our way to the dump because we gotta get rid of all the stuff in the back of the truck or the back of the van. And I hope that this will fit in the back of the van with all that stuff in there because we didn't think that through. But hopefully we'll be okay. See what I'm saying? Why do people have to park like that? Alright. The genius right here. This guy pulled right up on me. So now I can't open the back end of my truck. It is the truck's fault. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Probably gonna blend all this in and make it one long video or something like that. I don't know what I'll do. But, alright guys, until next time, I'll see y'all. Bye.